Hello and welcome. Today we are headed to Hogwarts in Harry Potter House Cup competition. Harry Potter House Cup Competition is a game for two to four players, designed by Nate Heiss and Kimmy Mandel, and published by the OP Games. In this game, each player controls one of the houses of Hogwarts and must level up their students in order to uh, complete challenges and ultimately earn the most points in the House Cup Competition. To set up, each player first takes a common room board and their three students, uh, whose skills all start at level one. Each player also receives two basic lesson cards and two knowledge tokens. On the board, a level 1 location card is randomly drawn and placed face up next to the classrooms. Then two level 2 and one level 3 locations are also chosen at random and placed face down above the round tracker to be revealed later on. Lastly, the basic and advanced lesson decks and the easy and hard challenge decks are all shuffled separately. And the top three cards from each deck are drawn and placed face up beneath. A game is played over seven rounds, each of which consists of two phases. Uh, phase one is classes, uh, and on a player's turn during this phase, they must place a student at an open location on the board, and they may, if they wish, also have that student complete a lesson card from their hand. If choosing both actions, they may be done in either order. Lessons require a certain skill level in one of the three classes and offer rewards for completion. Uh, levels in classes, as well as additional resources, are gained from the spaces on which the students are placed. After all students have attended class, they are all returned to their common rooms, and the second phase, Challenges, begins. During this phase, players may assign their students to challenge cards in their hands. A player may attempt up to two easy challenges, or one easy and one hard challenge per round. Similar to lessons, challenges require uh, skills in certain classes, but sometimes also require the player to spend knowledge tokens. Many challenges reward the player uh, with house cup points upon completion, represented by gems. Each gem is worth 10 points, and when earned, they get placed into each house's hourglass. After the seventh round, players tally up their points. In addition to 10 points for each gem in their hourglass, players earn an additional 10 points for each uh, skill of their students that they've leveled up all the way to level seven, and also 10 additional points for each pair of knowledge and magic tokens that they have in their possession. Then naturally the player who has the most total points wins the game. Now let's get started. All right, so before we get started here, uh, playing this game, it's only proper that we introduce ourselves. My name is D, and today I will be uh, representing the uh, Slytherin house. And, Which is uh, where you were placed anyway, right? Naturally, yes. Pottermore. In Pottermore, yeah, yes. you were a Slytherin. <laughs> yes. I'm Hello, everyone. Oh, yeah, who are you? I am Will. Uh-huh. Uh, I don't know what my Harry Potter name is, but I am a Hufflepuff. Playing as Gryffindor. Ah, uh, you're a poser. I'm a, I'm a Hufflepuff denier. I mm. refuse to be saddled with Hufflepuff. Actually, that's not true. I uh, I take pride in my Hufflepuffery. Um, At least someone does. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Cedric Diggory was a Hufflepuff. And he died. Why are you trying to cheat me? What? You, what, what? I heard Professor Snape say um, uh, 90 points to Gryffindor. That's what... <laughs> are you... I saw that. You're trying to cheat. Sorry. You're always looking for an edge in every game. And people think, oh, Will, he's overreacting. I'm a Slytherin! I, gotta I know. I get, get ahead. You know. I get it. All right. So look, let's get playing. You're the first player. First player in this game is the person who most recently went to school, uh, which is you. You have, you know, Harry, Ron, and Hermione, of course. You got, we both have our two knowledge. We have our two lessons. I don't know if you've looked at yours yet. I have looked at mine. Let's probably look at mine, huh? Yeah. I mean, you can't, probably not going to be able to well, use it. Ronald Weasley. I'm going right to charm. Right to charm. Because okay. when I think of Ron, I think of charm. Now, this is a class in charisma, right? It's like to, you know, confidence, nope. talking to people. Nope. It's like a communications class. No. So I, um... You, get, you also get a, a challenge, an easy, ch a basic challenge, I should say. Right. Let me look at uh, all Your selection. You're going to have to help me with this a little bit, because the glare. Goodness. It's not great. You know what? I'm going to go all the way for Hail the Bus, because it's a lot of points. Okay. And I want to get there. Sure. Peer into the pensive. Ron completed a lesson. Oh, why? He's going to cast an enlargement charm mm -hmm. on what I'm not going to say. 
Might be a body part, might not be. So the reward in that is a, um, any, any, student any student gets a level, gets a in, level charm. in charm. And, and charms, yes, charms. I think Harry. I'm just going to learn one in charms. Some Harry charms. Fine. All right, and since this is done, like that. Yeah, go, go in that discard. And that is my turn. Glad that everything's working out for you guys. That's Rico. I wish I could go to charm school. Crab is going to go to the professor's office, and I'm going to get uh, two uh, magic. Okay. The magic in this game, as you can see, are represented by uh, big floppy hats. Are you completing any lessons? Uh, I'm not. How right, could cool. I? I have no level two skills. I'm going to have Hermione. Hermione. Go to potions. Okay. She's going to up her potions by one. All right. She can also take another easy challenge because of this symbol that looks mm -hmm. like underwear. I always look at it and I think whitey tighties. Looks nothing like underwear. It looks, looks like my whitey tighties. Looks like a I had V-neck whitey tighties, so <laughs> figure it out. <laughs> figure that out. She's gonna take the weight, or the weighing of wands. Right. The weight of wands. You can keep those face down. No, I'm gonna keep my challenges right. apparent to you. Just because it's easier for me to remember what I have. And it says in the rule book that you're allowed to do that, so. All right, if you want. Draco will go to defense against the Dark Arts. Uh, he'll level up one and one. Then. Okay, go. Do it. And then I'll take... You want to board the Hogwarts Express? Sure. Why not? That I feel like, fun. you know, I always think of the scene on there on the Hogwarts Express where Which they're one? eating, like, candy yeah, and stuff. One. Okay, yeah. And I can't help but to think that, like, I'd be screwed in the world of Harry Potter. Like, fat people in general just aren't welcome. It's like a... It's like they're trying to use scare tactics into getting people not to eat... Like a lot of food, I feel like, you know? I don't know. How, how do you figure? Well, because don't they, like, the jelly beans, like, make your voices change and stuff? Don't they, like, have animal sounds? Yeah, that's, like, that's, like, fun. It's not, like, a drawback. So. Yeah, but what if you ate, like, a handful at once? Um, I think you'd just be diabetic because you'd constantly be eating candy. <laughs> Probably. Like Never-ending supply of weird magical candy. I think Harry's going to go here. To the Privet Pay Drive. a knowledge, which okay. I have to do to go to Privet Drive. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. And then I can choose another character yeah, to, gain, to gain a level. Yeah, in anything. I'm going to choose my homeboy Ron. You know, ride or die Ron, as we call him. Ron Weasley TM. Uh, he's going to gain a level in Dark Arts. So, so Crab and Goyle are not trademarked, which is good to know. So I can, I can start... Well, actually, you know what? Ron's going to gain a level in Charm. I can Sorry, go ahead. I can start my own stories about the adventures of Crab and Goyle, and I don't have to worry about... They're you know, not trademarked? No. I mean, Draco is, and all three of yours are. Uh, but Crab and Goyle... I wonder if any of the other ones are. Cedric. Luna is. That's it. Hmm. Well, good to know. I'm going to get rich. <sighs> Hello, I'm Detective Inspector Crab. This is my partner, DCI Goyle. Yes. You just write like a cop. You write like it's just Midsummer Murders. It's, it's just Midsummer Murders, but it's Crab and Goyle. Crab and Goyle. All can right. Can um, do that lesson. Yeah. Do it then. Yeah. Harry Potter has two charm. I can replace any or all face-up lesson cards, and then take a basic lesson. Oh no, any lesson. Okay. If you want to. I'm gonna replace this one. Can you do it? I I don't have fingernails. And I'm going to replace. No, I'll keep that one out. It wasn't replace this one. I was just moving it. Okay. Place that one. It's the exact same one. Yeah. <laughs> well, you can't replace it again. Then leave that one. And lastly, let's replace this one. I don't like it. I don't like the way it looks. I don't like the way it smells. All right, I'll take one. All right, well, I'm going to still take the one that's going to help me the most okay. immediately. Taking this one. Detective Inspector Goyle. Mm. You know, Goyle, yeah, this guy's like an MMA fighter now. Is it an actor? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. At least he was last time I saw him. I'm not keeping him that close. I'm going to the library. That's more in, in line with what knowledge. my intention was. Yes, three knowledge. He's yeah. smart. Everyone always said that about Goyle. That's what they know about Goyle. He's... All the Slytherin really are best known for their intelligence. So we can re we can return our students now. Everyone's been placed. Can I have Draco? No. Fine. Now what, sir? Now we can do challenges if we're able to. I, I cannot. Can you? I didn't update anyone in the dark arts, so I don't think so, no. Cool. That's it, then. Mm-hmm. 
You become first player. Yeah, we move on to round two. So only in the two player variant does the first player change between rounds. Where we go, what's our new location? What is it? But you didn't move the round marker Whatever. up. Whatever, it's the three broomsticks. Mm. Go get drunk. So your player has to have a, it has to be at a third level of anything. A level three skill to go there. Yeah. Yes, you and you get three, three magic. magic. Well, right, I know what I'm right, doing right away. Right. Goyle is gonna learn charms. Exactly. All right, nice. And I still have no lessons. So, so D, mm -hmm. what's your favorite Harry Potter movie? Ask a bit. Wow, you're just certain. You know. Yeah, it's not really that close, honestly. Okay. Well, you're just, I mean, it is in many ways the most artful one. Um, it's the best one. Another challenge for you. La -di -da. Who's your favorite character in the Prisoner of Azkaban? Is it Lupin? Is it Sirius uh, Black? Uh, this is barely in that movie. And it's probably Sweet. Lupin, because Lupin's... Isn't man. he like a rat like the whole time? No, that's... No, that's the teacher guy. No. What? what? It's... Not the teacher guy. That's the fat guy. Peter Pettigrew. You're an idiot. You don't know anything. You know, so Peter, Peter, Peter Pettigrew's your favorite character? That's exactly what I said. Okay. Can All I, right. Can I go again? Do you have a lesson you can complete? I bet you do. No, you don't. Well, yes, I do. Yes, you, well, no, you don't. No, I don't. <laughs> I am going to have Draco work. go here now. Okay, you owe and two I knowledge and one magic. going to pay up. So you may. He can level up twice. Twice. And he's going to take both in uh, in charms. No, I'm not going to do that. But I am done with Draco. I think Ron is going to go here. Pay a knowledge mm -hmm. to get Hermione up to three in potions. Okay. That'll be that. You're up. Okay. Crab. I guess I'll just go there. Potions. That's not that's not crab. That's crab. There we go. And what lesson are you gonna learn, guy? Don't put your hand on the stove. Don't stick your head in the oven. Uh, oh, there's one. See, I was often compared mm -hmm. to uh, Vincent Crabb growing up. You, you want to guess why? Um, boy, God, there's so because you're because uh, you're both white. That's it. You ne no, <laughs> it was because of personality. Oh, yeah, we both have a, that wit, sense of humor. So Hermione is going to the three broomsticks. Yeah, to get three hats. three magic tokens. Now the reason that she can do that is because Ron so intelligently gave her a third level in potions. Oh, she completed a lesson as well. The invigoration thing. The in, it's, a, it's what it says, the invigoration thing? The invigoration draught. Draft? Draft. Wow. Is it not draught? No. Draft is D-R-A-F-T. I think it's draught. I'm going to go with draught. <laughs> so she gets to level up in, uh, or anyone can level up in potions, but I'm just going to do it to her. Um, God, I could have said that better. And uh, she's at the level four there now, and a quince. <clears throat> so that's that's that. Can we return to our houses? No. Our common rooms? I just said no. Why not? What can you possibly have to do? You already did your... Yeah, I'm taking my guys back. I'm not listening to you. <laughs> All right, I'm going to be completing a challenge this time around. Me too. Maybe more than one. I'm just going to put that right there, because it's just going to be him. Well, first, I'm going to just uh, complete the journey to platform from platform nine and three quarters because Draco has three charm and two defense. Uh, so I get a book uh, for one knowledge. knowledge. And I, get, I get the first gem of the game, ten points to Slytherin. Wow! Congratulations. Mm -hmm. I'll just put this in my complete challenge. So, <clears throat> Harry Potter and Ron combine for exactly two potion and three dark arts between them, meaning that they can complete this contract, which is the weighing of wands, which yes. is. I get a knowledge, and believe it or not, a gem, too, for my 10 points. Uh, the Wang of Wands guy. Okay, so you get one gem. Harry and, Harry and Ron, they both took out their wands, and they weighed them. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, fun. Hermione fun. only has four in potions. This requires six in potions. Yeah. However, you can use a magic token as many times as you need to substitute for a level. Mm -hmm. I'm using two of the three that I just got from her. And now she has six, right, so, so nice. that's another three gems, because it's a 30-pointer. Cheating. Okay. 
That is that, sir. Well, you're back to first player? Yep. Round three. Round three. Yeah, keep holding the rule book. I'm gonna keep holding this. You may go. All right. I think I'm gonna go right back to the broomsticks. All right. Getting through magic. She could do that because she's at level four in potions. Now, guy, you're up. Goyle, go here. Pay your knowledge. This is mine, by the way. So I'm gonna, so I'm gonna keep this next round. I kind of go in there. I also got a hat and any lesson of my choice. I don't like that you took the first player token already. I mean, it doesn't change the order for this round. It's just next round, you get it. Yeah. You were gonna get it anyway. No, I wasn't there. I'm already first this round. Oh, no, I'm not. Well, you're not. Okay. That's fine. All right, I guess if you just wanted what was on there. I'm just saying you're gonna get it no matter what. Well, you could have gone there. True, I could have. You it. blocked me from doing that. Uh, and then uh, as far as these, you never asked me what my favorite Harry Potter movie is, guy. I'm sorry, I didn't know you wanted me to. You know, I feel like it's a one-way conversation. What's your favorite Harry Potter movie? I feel like we need to go to couples therapy, D. Yeah. I feel like we're not communicating, and what's my favorite Harry Potter movie? It's probably Azkaban, so we're very in line with that, because I think it's the most, uh, it's more film than movie in many ways, that's what I like about it. What's your thoughts on the fourth film? Because a lot of people from our generation love that one. I go back and forth on Goblet of Fire. Yeah. Uh, there are times where I watch it and I think it's very boring. Uh, and then there are times where I watch it and I think it's pretty good. Uh, it's definitely not my favorite. Uh, interesting that you fluctuate that much Probably, on it. yeah, you know, it depends on the mood I'm in, I guess. I, you know, I would say it's, it's at best uh, mid-tier. I always thought it's the least Harry Potter feeling of the Harry Potters. It's like if you took, it, I don't know why, it just feels like a pause button on the main story. Like it's well, like its own yeah, thing. Yeah, and then at the bit. last second, they're like, yeah. oh my God, Voldemort. I don't know. That's how I always felt. I never was a big fan of it. I could take any, I guess I'll, uh, the Norwegian Ridgeback. Get the rehome one. Mm, I get the rehome a puppy. All right. Um, yeah, so. That's kind of my opinion on it. Mm -hmm. I think we made a lot of enemies in this video, guy. I don't know. I have Draco go here. Pay, wow, you gotta pay yeah. quite a fee for that. Yep. There you go. I get two levels. So I'm gonna go uh, one in uh, that, and I think I'm gonna go One in what? In, one in oh, sorry, charms. One in charms and one in dark arts, and then I can do a lesson, I'm pretty sure, here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna complete this. I'm gonna pay my last hat for the time being. Well, that's magic. I can do, it's the same one you got a hat earlier. I can replace any or all face-up challenge cards and then I can take uh, a, uh, I can take a challenge card, any challenge card. So, so it's kind of the same, except with challenge cards instead of lessons. Actually, what? Replace them all, Will. What? Yeah. I was just thinking about which one I want. Aha! I'll just put these here for now. All right, fine. All right. Probably just go to the bottom of the deck. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. Who knows, maybe he just helped me. I'm gonna take this one. What was that? A six charm? Yeah. <sighs> the world is waiting with baby well, I guess breath. Ron is gonna just go here. Okay. Gain another charm. He's so charming. And he's going to defeat, grab this contract here. Wasn't there an NBA player named Vincent Crab? No, Alan Crab. Ah. Oh, he'll just do the potions, I guess. And, uh. All right. Okay. Oh, crap. Receive letters from no one. Now can I. Divvy out my guys and my like, yeah, okay, it's cute. Yeah, I guess. Cute. Cool. What are you doing? Well, Harry and Ron combine for the five charm, um, two defense of the dark arts, and here's my one knowledge. Mm -hmm. And in return, we get 30 points or three gems. 
Okay. That was the Hail the Night bus. You know that favorite part? Famous scene in it's Azkaban. Uh, Azkaban. Yeah. No that scene always kind of that scene freaked me out when I first saw that movie. I was right at that age where I was still an idiot. And so like when that bus twenty nine. You know, voodoo, shrunken heads kind of scared me, and then the bus got all right, so what is what is Hermione doing? She's got enough, more than enough for the four potions to defeat a servant of Voldemort. Mm -hmm. But she only has one in the Dark Arts, so I'm mm. going to pay a magic to supplement that. All right. But in return, her reward is a magic, so I'm just going to keep the one I paid. And two more gems. And two more gems. All right. So I'm up now. I'm kicking your butt. First up, uh, so Draco has enough alone to board the Hogwarts Express. Uh, he's got the four charm. He's got more than two of that. So I get a hat. It's magic. A, a magic and two gems. And now uh, these two, with the magic as earned, have enough to do this one, which is uh, view the mirror of Irised. So they're going to do that. They have the two potions from Crab and then the four from... So how many points is that? So it's two more points. And I get the, well, I have to spend this, but I get another one, so I'm just going to keep that. Okay, so you would earn a magic back, so you just keep the one you yes, have. Yes, and now I have uh, two more gems as well. 20 points for two gems. We're only level four, or round four, which means we get our, our round next, four. Uh, what do we got? Uh, Weasley's Wizard Weezes. Hell yeah. Choose. Any player to gain two levels in the highest class it has. You need to pay a magic and a knowledge to do it. Oof. No knowledge. <laughs> I have. And well, you're up first, so you should probably do that. Goyle. Goyle. He's going there. He's getting two in charm. Two in charms. That was smart, because I was going to say, if you realize if you had done Draco or any of the, like, you would have to pay a magic mm -hmm. to get to level five, so smart, smart, smart. Hermione Granger. He's going to be going to potions. Okay. That moves her up to five. Now to prove I could get to the fifth level, I have to pay a magic. Yep. There, it is paid. That's your demonstration of knowledge. And then I can take any contract, and I will be taking any easy contract, and I will be taking challenge. I'll be taking walk with Mooney Wormtail, Mooney Wormtail, Padfoot, and Prongs. Just walk with them. Yeah. Just go for a Grima just Wormtail. Go for a saunter. I knew Brad Dourif would find a way to weasel his way into the Harry Potter universe. Being American won't hold him back. Draco is going to go here. Yeah, three magic. Yeah. I thought about going there and blocking you on that again, but, you know, I'm nice. Nice. Who's going? Ron. Ron Weasley. Ron's going to go here. Okay. So that's two knowledge. And a hard challenge. Mm. Mm, which one do I want? Be my guest. Oh. You better win this game. The time you're taking to just Ooh, choose I'm one of Cosmayhem Cos and Great. Ministry. Great. Okay, cool. Put a new one out. Can I go? How dare you insult me so? Uh, Crab is going to learn some defense against the Dark Arts. And I will take this. Dave, have you ever been to Harry Potter Wizarding World in Orlando? No, I've never been to Florida. You've never been to Florida? I've never been, no. Jealous. No. <laughs> um, Harry's going here. Right? Yes, Harry's boosting his charm. And he's going to be taking this contract here. All right, now we can do our challenges. Okay. All right, so uh, Crab and Goyle are going to do this one together. They easily, What is it? Uh, oh, it's receive letters from no one. What does that mean? So what's that a reference to? Uh, Did Harry ever receive letters from no one? Probably. I, yeah, I don't All remember right, Well, you gain a knowledge gain. and one gem from yeah. that. You're not doing great. And then and what's up? Draco is going to do this by oh, himself. Oh, six charm on his own? Yeah. Oh, because you paid two magic. Yeah, so that's uh, another... Three gems. That's it? Yeah. Embarrassing. I will. All right. Harry and Ron are going to pay two knowledge based on the requirements, as well as between them, with Harry's three charm and Ron's four, gets their charm rating up to seven, which is what's needed for this. Okay. I get a level for one of the two. 
as well as four gems. Alright. Some more dark defense. art. Defense of the dark. D. Yeah, D. Defense of the D. And then Hermione's gonna travel by port key. I, again, I don't, I forget, I need to catch up on my Harry Potter. I don't remember what that means. That's the goblet, you know, where they have, like, there's like a, they like hold a thing and they like go through like tornado to the World Cup. So she's going to she's going to get twenty points for this, and a basic lesson. Ooh, you cheat, which is going to be this one. Okay. Okay. Did oh, and trial by poor key goes into here, and that will be that. All right. Up to round five, I'm first player. Um, That's the first player token. That's not a student. <laughs> I was gonna put that down. Hermione, yep, is going to go here. All right, two books and Clark, a two knowledge and, a, and an advanced, advanced challenge. Advanced challenge, Again. hard challenge. I don't know why you. Would. It's advanced. It's hard. Well, here it's advanced. Well, it's hard. I'm not talking about the challenges. All right, and uh, yeah. All right. That's the Join the Order of the Phoenix challenge. All right, Draco. Oh, wait, was that Hermione? Shoot. Yeah. It's good that you didn't go. Uh, Hermione is going to complete this challenge, which is you called... You can't do a challenge. It's a lesson. Okay. It's called Amortentia. Okay. Brew Amortentia. She needs to have four levels of potions. She has f five and a magic, which I'm going to pay right now, to get two knowledge. Did you pay for level five? Yes, okay. I did when I did it. And a level in anything. Okay. She's going to level up in dark arts. D. Three magic. Someone's got plans. So, you know, I'm going to have Ron do this. Ron is going to go here. Okay. So I owe a magic and a knowledge to mm -hmm. go there. And I can choose any character to get two levels in their highest class. So you want to do one of mine? Yeah, uh, Draco. Uh, no, I'm kidding. Um, Harry's going to move up. There's five. That's my last, last magic. magic. Oh, he's out of magic. And then up to six now in right. Dark Arts. Is that your turn? That was my turn. Crab is going to go here. Uh, and I'll take... That. Okay. Where crap? Oh, we got a level in dark arts. I don't have enough magic. I think I'm just gonna collect uh, more knowledge. Three knowledge for Will. That's it. I'm gonna finally complete this basic lesson I started the game with with what Draco. It? Uh, it's the uh, cat's a disillusionment charm. Uh, it's got the three. Charm skill uh -huh, I need, so you have and that. I can use an occupied space this turn. And he's also going to go and learn defense against the dark arts and collect and an easy challenge. I think I'll take this. Easy challenge D, it's what they called you. Yep. It's that. Oh, that's that then, right? That is that. All right, well then, let's collect our peeps. Hmm, good point. All right, well, I guess Ron's not doing any. All right. All right, I'm first. Uh, between them, they have six potions, uh, eight dark arts, and then here's three knowledge. And you get and I get sixty right. for joining the Order of the Phoenix. That's three, three, four, five. Yes, the members of the Order of the Phoenix they are, but not Ron. Ron can't join. No redheads allowed, Ron. All right. Sorry. So here's the deal. Uh, so uh, Draco is going to evade the Dementor, which gets him a level and 10 points for me. Choose his level. Now I'm going to get the level here. I'm going to do it in, I believe, Defense Against the Dark Arts. I have to pay for that. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to, though, because I'm going to get one from this. So I'm just not going to worry about it. All right. So you're just going to forego yeah. your These one These two are going to join the Crab Dueling Club. club. Uh, they have the bare minimum, not the bare minimum, but they, Just they, they need it. They have more than so enough potion. But, uh, 20 gems. 20 gems and a hat, and a hat. which I don't get. I don't get, because I spent it. Can I have it? No. So two more gems there. Okay, now we're on to round six. 
Which Last means, Flippy. Yeah, what we got? This is the story of a girl. All right, it's uh, Godric's Hollow. You have to be level five in something to do either ability, which is to get two knowledge and two magic, or to get ten points and a hard level challenge, or any challenge. Any challenge, yeah. Interesting. Oh, oh I am first. Yeah. Right, because I you did not do that. I'm, I forgot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. So Draco, I'm going to do first. I got this, which okay. is... Uh, you need five in the dark arts, mm -hmm. one magic, and you can plus one level in two different classes. Yeah, so he's going to do with the dark arts. And he's going to do charms. So now what? Another hat to pay for that. I already uh, put one in there. No, to pay for the level five. Oh, right. This advanced lesson can go there. Now he's going. I'm just gonna go there. Okay. The level Up seven. to level seven. And you get okay. to choose a easy challenge. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what an idiot. All right. That took forever, guy. Yeah, so Very slow. Very slow. Ron is just going to get magic. Okay. Three magic for me. You excited for that new Harry Potter video game RPG that was announced? Yeah. I mean, is that a Sony exclusive? I don't think so. I don't remember. Okay, good. That would be horrible for work. Remember year, everyone has been saying that about years and years and years ago. I remember being like, like 13 and being like, they should make this into an RPG. Back when it would have been not very good, you know, because it would have been on what? PlayStation 2. So some of those PS2 there. Harry Potter games weren't half bad. Two books, and I get... I'm going to take this. Oh. No. I think Hermione is just going to go to potions. Okay. Get her one step closer to seven. And take Vanquish the Heir of Slytherin, Draco. Who's the heir of Slytherin? Three more knowledge. Wow, please. that's a lot of knowledge. I guess he needed to complete a contract, but or something. I don't know. Wow. All right. I don't. That, so it's gonna be challenge time. Hey, now. Uh, I didn't go with Harry. Oh, jeez, I forgot. I'm first You're really player. great. You're really good at this. Forgot him first player. You're amazing turn. at this game. Thank you. Harry's gonna go here to Godric Hollow. Okay. He is a level five. Ten points. Ten points in there, and I get any contract. I'm going to be taking Find the Wand Maker. Okay. Find the money, Chris Money Maker. Throwback to a video that hasn't come out yet. Hilarious. I believe we can... I choose not to. Turn. You're first. I am. All right, so uh, Draco is going to spend these three books that he needs, because he's got the what skills are you doing? required to ascend the lightning struck tower by himself. He's got five and... Ah, back to the future. Six, so he gets... Uh, I get six gems for that, and then uh, these guys are going to do... Uh, enter the Chamber of Secrets, for we get another book I have to spend there. Mm -hmm. uh, and that's another three gems. So six plus three is nine, nine so you get nine gems. Yeah. That's going to help you a little bit. it will catch up a bit. Oh, failure. All right, well, I need two knowledge, three charm, and six in the dark arts, which between Harry and Ron is easily done. Uh, I get uh, any ad uh, advanced lesson, <laughs> any advanced lesson, just I get an advanced lesson in four points, four gems. I guess if this is the last turn, I could just go all out with the magic. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna take this advanced lesson. Did you give me my gems already? For the first thing, yeah. yeah. okay. And then the next one, she alone has more than enough potion, dark art, and then here's one knowledge okay. for another three gems. And that would be that for the lesson phase. We move up to the final round. I'm the first player again. Mm -hmm. All right, fudge it. Um, Harry's just gonna go dark arts. Cool. All right, so you, right? No, I didn't. Where did he go? He slid under. He's hiding. 
<laughs> in the three burn sticks. I just want to make sure that I did this right, guy. Yes, You're I did. Going. Harry's going up. Moving Four on seven. up. Take your challenge. What's he going to do now? All right, you get 10 points. Mm -hmm. And you can take any challenge. Collect three magic with Hermione. Okay. Who is also mm -hmm. going to complete that lesson. What's that? It's a five. Uh, she has five in potions. It's one knowledge per level for your player with the highest dark arts level. So I get seven knowledge tokens. Great. That's a good one. Oh, I guess I can just go there. You can see why I wanted to move Harry up first. Four, five, six, seven. Uh, yeah, you can have a warm cup of butter beer when we're done. He's going there. He's going to level up in charms. And he's going to take that. No? No warm butter beer when no. we're done? Nope. Butter beer. You ever been to London, D? You ever been to England? I've been to Heathrow Airport. So you have. That's the closest, I could say, to having been in London. Well, people always say that Heathrow is like an amalgam of what England is. Do right? they? Yes. It's a bunch of just like tourist trap shops and <laughs> restaurants. Is that? That's what it is. And, and terminals. Yeah. Ross is going to go there, take a magic. All right. And what advanced one would I want? If the plan is to have her do that, then it has to be one that doesn't involve potions, so it's going to have to be this one. All right. And Goyle's up. Mm-hmm. And he's going to go here. Do it. All right, so that's yep, two of each, which is pretty mm -hmm. good in the last round, because that could just be 20 points. I really don't have a path to victory here, but I'm nope. trying to make it as da, close da, as da, I da, can. Da, da, da. <laughs> Such a douche. All right. All right. Uh, I'm first, so quickly. Three knowledge, which is what this requires. Mm -hmm. And between them, they have exactly eight in the dark arts, so that means they can drink tea with the Hogwarts High Inquisitor. Okay. So who's, uh, who's that guy? The Hogwarts High Inquisitor? High Inquisitor? Wasn't that uh, Umbridge? Anyway. One... Two, three, four, five, because this is a five-pointer. Okay. And then Hermione has more than five. She has six potion. Two charm. She doesn't have. She only has one charm, so one magic used. And one knowledge. Okay. And in turn, she gets three gems, 30 points for walking with Mooney, Wormtail, Padfoot, and Prongs. Again, All I guess. Right. Uh, so Crab is going to do uh, make the Quidditch team. Yeah, of crab. All, of nice. all people. So he, by himself, he has the two, two, and three that he needs. So I get a level. What is he, like, motivational team captain or yeah, something? Sure. He's uh, not even a player. He's a like... level in potions. That doesn't matter. And I get uh, 20, uh, 20 gems, or two gems, 20 points. And then these two are going to team up to spend those two to uh, defend the seven potters, of all things. They've got the, the <laughs> seven and seven. What is what they're known for. Yeah, and then the 60 points for me. That's five. That's six. No, it's five. It's six. Look, again. Yeah, count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven. You did too many. Take one out. That's the game? Yeah. Now it's just a matter of scoring. I'm not going to... It's not going to be that close. Why don't we do the inverse? So usually you would count your gems uh -huh. and add tens. So why don't we add gems to it then just count all our all right. gems? So uh, I've got 20... Or, okay, so I guess we should explain what we're doing then. Well, you get 10 points for everyone who's level 7. Right, so we each get 10. We each get 10 because me, Harry, you, Draco. Both in Defense Against the Dark Arts. So one more kind of jam each to our tubes. Oh, okay. I see. But you see how you I want to do this? do it like this, right? Yeah. Oh, oh you're doing great. Well, look at these Christmas colors. I just realized how festive. All right, and so I'm going to get... And then you get 10 points for each pair of Magic and Knowledge, which I mentioned in the intro. So I get 20 points for that. You're going to get 30. I right? get 30. I have 3 Knowledge and 3 Magic left over. And now, it, I mean, you can literally see... That he has more than me. But yeah, but let's count let's it. Let's count them up. So there's you. Mm -hmm. If you include the 90 points that I got at the beginning, it might be close. That he made me uh, lose for some reason. That was not the most efficient way of doing it, Will. All right. I have 330 points. You have 410. Did I mean that wrong? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, 
That's 10, 410. Yeah, so, say, that sounded too close. 410 for Gryffindor. Mm -hmm. 330. Just for like in the books, Gryffindor cheats to win. Mm -hmm. I cheated Favoritism to win. from the uh, powers that be mm -hmm. have resulted in another Slytherin defeat. You know, what's one of these games where, man, like after that, like the first turn, I was like, ah. <laughs> Remember how I didn't do that one uh, lesson until like mm -hmm. turn five? <laughs> you know, early on I was like, I don't know if he has a strategy. So I think I got I, this. It wasn't so that was like I had a strategy. Second round, I was like, that, I, I think I've won already. It's that like I like any strategy. Like I think the first thing you did was like the thing I wanted to do. Yeah, <laughs> so I was like, oh, I needed charms. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we're gonna have a review. Look, of bias this game. towards Gryffindor is a thing. It is. It is. Uh oh, I'm stuck. <laughs> If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, subscribe. Uh, feel free to share it if you're interested. Uh, of course, subscribe uh, Subscribe to the channel. I mentioned that, but it's always nice to see that number go up. Uh, and uh, hit the notification bell so you know when our next video comes out. That video will be our review of this game, presumably. Mm-hmm. Barring tragedy. Perfect score. Uh, but we'll see what scores it gets. 110%. That's not how it works. And that's, I think, going to do it. Yeah, I apologize for my um, for this video. My Harry Potter. I, I don't apologize for the video. I'm saying I apologize for my lack of Harry Potter knowledge. I actually have read the books more than once, each one, and I've seen I, most of the movies. I cannot say that. So there I you have go. seen each of the movies at least. I've seen the last two. Something like that. Look, I I have a moral and ethical responsibility as a film buff. To not reward movie studios for splitting books into two stories. I feel stories. like those are generally well-regarded films, though. If you were an actual film buff, you'd watch them and have an opinion on this them. This says it's the man insane. who owns the three Hobbit films. Goodbye, everybody. Uh, it's not true. See you next time. But bye anyway. No, I, I am talking about myself. Oh, bye. that's true. Yeah. <laughs>